So today, I wanted to do a change of pace of a video. I wanted to talk about one of the worst Roblox updates I've literally ever seen on the platform. Now, this isn't worse than the time they actually took out ticks, but this is on a whole nother level. As you guys seen by the thumbnail, Roblox is basically removing private servers, or at least somewhat removing private servers for the most of the people. And before I start, before anybody comments, what's this game in the background, Corny? It's Riot Fall. And also, don't forget to subscribe, please. Now, if you go to private servers, you'll probably see that you can join private servers, you can make private servers, Servers, all that sort of stuff, but there's a slight issue with it. So I'm gonna quote Creekcraft here on his Twitter because I think this is probably the most reliable source I can find with this. It seems that Roblox has made it so that in order to join VIP servers, you must A, be verified with 13 plus with an ID or be friends directly with the server owner. Otherwise, you can no longer join VIP servers. And the reason why I'm making this video just now is because I thought either this was a glitch or this would be taken out because obviously this is a really terrible idea. But now it's been a month and it's still here, so it's probably here to stay. Now, in my opinion, this wouldn't be that big of an issue if you could just go ahead and change it, but here's the issue. You cannot change it unless you're verified 13 plus with an ID. And as someone who didn't get their ID until they were 18 years old, that's kind of a big issue because what 13 year old has an ID or a passport? And if you're lucky enough to have a school ID, it doesn't matter, those don't work either. Has to be a government official ID. And as a person who spends way too much Robux on VIP servers a month, I think it's probably over 3,000 Robux I spend a month on just keeping up private servers alone for my streams and all that stuff. That's $30 I'm never getting back, and also $30 that I can't even use now because people can't join my VIP servers. So not only am I burning $30 a month, I literally can't even stream in private servers anymore because they just don't work. I have to join public servers and have cheaters in my lobbies, and there's nothing I can do about it. I'll be streaming Phantom Forces with like over 150 people and the lobby doesn't fill up because people just don't have verified age Roblox accounts. And if I, an 18 year old with a verified ID on a star creator Roblox account can't use VIP servers correctly, I doubt a regular person can too. And I just can't help but think why. Why would Roblox do this? I have never heard, literally ever, anybody ever complaining about VIP servers. It's like they're fixing a problem that wasn't even there in the first place. I can understand age-restricting games. That's fair game. If a game's mature, so be it. People can't play it. That's fine. But if a E for everyone game, like Adopt Me, has a VIP server, everybody should be able to play it. It's not even a matter of children's safety because it's so much easier to get a person onto an external website like Discord instead of bringing somebody into a private server and then going through the filtered Roblox chat. Unless there's some security breaking thing about private servers, I just don't see why this is a thing. So let me know in the comments what you think. Are you affected by this and how are you affected by this and why do you think Roblox did this? Because usually I have the answers for everything, but I honestly just don't have an answer for this. It just doesn't make sense to me. It just really doesn't. And as a person who uses VIP servers a lot, it just breaks my heart. It really does. So I hope I didn't ruin your day with this news, but I hope you have a good rest of your day. Stay safe. Goodbye.